back to my youtube channel it's your girl Zinke if you don't already know me and today guys I'm actually back with another video yes it's going to be a vlog <laughs> I feel like now every time I post a video um it is a vlog and I can't do anything guys and I'm sorry for the echo in this bathroom But anyway, child, welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys do stay. To all my Wednesday kings and queens, welcome back, guys. And I hope you guys are enjoying my channel this far. And to all of those who are new to my channel, all my new Wednesday kings and queens, welcome to my channel. Welcome to the family, and I hope you guys do stay. And with that being said, guys, I am actually running very low on time as always uh, i have to prepare for our trip my sister i'm gonna explain the whole backstory of us traveling right now so what had happened was um my sister decided to go home which is a queenstown and then um she hit me up and was like girl can you take leave from work uh, so that CAA Queenstown because I'm going there and I'm gonna pass through Pretoria. I'm gonna go to Joburg first to pick up some things and then I'll pass by you at Pretoria and then we can go together. So I was like, say no more, girl. Already I was going through a lot of things, a lot of emotions. Um, the side because of looking for a place because me and my boyfriend are busy looking for a place and that has been one of the most stressful things i've ever encountered in my life i've never had to like go apartment hunting and it's so stressful but uh, i feel like this trip and going away is going to help me in some way because at least uh, i'm going to have I'm going to be able to center myself and regroup and then when I come back, maybe I'll come back rejuvenated and ready to like um, handle anything that comes my way in terms of this, in terms of adjusting to a new place and all of that. So I was like, say no more. I took leave from work. Already I had a lot of days to take. So... So I took leave from work and then I was like, okay, we can go. So today is the actual trip day. This is, she came like two days ago, two days ago. And then um, today it's a Monday and it's a public holiday. I don't know what the date is. Um, today is a Monday and we are going to Queenstown today. This is the actual trip day. So, with that being said, let me not waste any more time, guys. Let us gaze up. I'm going to take a shower and then December. And then after that, we are going to head out. And it's very early in the morning, by the way. So, hopefully, hopefully we'll get there very soon and we'll get there very quick. So, with that being said... I've been saying a mouthful. Let me get to Ushamba and then when I'm done, we will continue and go. I love you, I love you, I love you. Until I, until I, I love you. now so Konangoku I don't know whether guys I've mentioned to you guys 
how my skin has been going through the most and i personally don't know Uguti. why Uguti, why is this happening to me because i've never had skin problems guys and <clears throat> personally i have not been consistent with my routine like my skincare routine actually i haven't been consistent with anything personally because even health wise i haven't been consistent with like drinking my water and um exercising all of those things that make your skin look good or at least do they help with your skin i haven't been doing all of those things except me i don't even eat breakfast anymore good i don't know whether those things affect your skin but my skin has been going through a lot and since bloemfontein since Bloemfontein actually before I moved before I moved I was just going through the most because obviously relocating is just something that takes a toll on a person so even like Anditi I knew a month prior that I'm moving during that month everything that's ch just changed like everything just went south for me in terms of um, being consistent with anything in my life and when I got this side, we've been so consumed in other things like work, looking for a place, and I haven't been taking care of my body. So I haven't been consistent with my water intake this side as well. I haven't been consistent with eating healthy. We've just been winging it when it comes to eating um, food. We haven't been consistent with like eating yogurt right so i don't know my skin just started to go it started getting worse guys i don't know whether you guys can see this and it started getting very much worse and at this point i was like you know what it is what it is and i'm gonna try my best when i come back from this trip because i feel like i did need to just get away and just to recuperate and everything so hopefully when i come back from this trip everything would make sense and it would balance and then i can go to i can start eating healthy and i can start working out we've been saying we're gonna be we're gonna work out since ndifikile and we've been talking about the same thing about working out but we, we never we never end up working out so hopefully when i come back i'm gonna be motivated to like work out and do all of those things that i need to do to actually take care of my body inside before i can focus on the external external part of my body so yeah guys i've just been going through a lot and my skincare routine changed all the things that i used to use that worked for my skin I started not buying them and because they are expensive and because now it costs had to be cut when it comes to buying things because obviously I'm moving I need to have money I resorted to like other alternatives when it comes to my skin and that has been the ratatata it has been the ghetto because look how my skin is and I will invest on my skin again when things are um, back to normal and that's a back to normal and don't but when things are back to normal or when I get back to a certain routine I will try and be consistent with my skincare routine but with that being said guys you I've been just going through it but okay I want to show you guys my travel fit it's nothing much, nothing glamorous, but I want to show you my um, my travel fit. And because at this place I could call like full length mirrors, I can't show you guys the way in the full length mirrors are corner. But I'm gonna try my best to like show you what I'm wearing and all of that. Um, those are just my toiletries and my makeup bag. But get here on the way in full length mirrors. So I'm wearing this black top from where is it from oh from Ewoleds they had a sale on them um i think i got it for 125 yeah 
I think I got, a, got them for 125 and then I am wearing these sweatpants which I got which I got <laughs> which I got from um, where did I get them I got them from I think it is cut to this job I don't want to lie here let me just make sure where I got them from oh so I got them from H&M and then I am and then I'm also going to be wearing these shoes that look like fake Yeezys as I said training as I said Mr. Price Mr. Price really planned us because I freaking love these shoes they look so cute and yo they are for me they are very comfortable sham but i'm gonna be wearing these shoes and then we will be out but first i need to go pack my toiletries and sip me okay okay my spoon again yeah uh well, to the car because you are yeah in this one hey yeah, I Guys, this is Puma. Yeah, it's like thing. It's a local vlog. This is Puma. Konangoku. And this is Vanati. We road trip. I want to go to the bathroom. Where's my? Ah, there. Do you want to go to the music? 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 I'm an easy journey. I'm going to go to the KP. I'm going to go to the I think that's a bad That's a little sandy, then I'm for a phone. Because can't vlog, I need to. It's a book, 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 Hello, my sister. Yo, so guys, um, we made it to Kronstadt. Konango, kusi se Kronstadt. Besuzo tena ukuja because we are hungry and we left Pretoria seeing a kanga anything. So now we are in Kronstadt and we just went into each hackers only to be disrespected. Yo, guys, I don't understand ukuti why. People have to have so much attitude towards Abanyabantu. Like, and then you get people Abakupa attitude. I don't understand. And there's a labi, and then we just pay attitude. And for next, because I mean, like, I end the sense because it's not as if umtu ufika kuye umniki attitude to myself. Ufiku right? 
yena suka pi attitude ngoku suku ngaya zuba kengoku hi i should go just to that one one time hey. the one that is on n1 because now we're gonna search the for the one that i, I don't know uh. but we just go there then we come back mm. but anyway enough with my rent section Konongoku, we are going to the grounds that we just found out to put it they don't have nandos and they don't have a chicken licking and that's the the two main places that we initially wanted to go because we want spicy food so see resorted to him steers ne? Yes, because yes. kfc guys you are putting this kfc life in so we resorted to east yes and then so we a pie in yamaya corner instead of burgers because i'm not no nah, i'm not craving a burger so we're gonna buy meat there and some chips and then yeah we will go to our next destination which is the proof of so good to gonna pass by ulondi kala siya kulondi kasi kusuka kulondi siya e proof so I'll talk to you guys when we get to her. Okay. So we'll talk to you guys when we get there. So fun to say I'm Just that this place is freaking hot. And I go Besuka Bella Kala at Pretoria. It was very chilly and it was cloudy. This side is very every state is very warm. And then I'm just get every state to go warm, but in Pretoria is with the aircon is not it's not consistent but anyway we'll talk now now it dynamite I better open and taste the dynamite wings I don't want to taste them now oh I pan bene le mon oh no card is in me this is figile I can't show you because I'm full to you. They're done. But I am not allowed. No, I'm not allowed to show the place. So but we are here and Oko Siamba and Asikaki go go kwana sezoja. Okay, let me show you how foresty it looks. Yeah, I know. It's in the middle of nowhere, laying down. But we're having mchachosi. Food. We are about to eat before we head to Bloemfontein. Guys, Nina, Nisha, 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 Yeah. 
Because last time was the last. Oh, you want ice cream or something? Yeah. And if you need to add chocolate to the ice cream. Non, <laughs> 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 making space all right okay as we go then we go home we are in hello <laughs> Okay. We are two hours away from home, which is a Queenstown. So, we just went to get some refreshments like water because we need water. And then setting on a pedal pops, which is my favorite. I love the this one. And I love the one. Uh, I don't. Know, I don't know how to explain it. But the other one. There's a, another one that comes in a purple package type of thing. So I love those two. Just this one and the purple one. Twenty-four liters from a grown start to cruise up. It's twenty-four liters of petrol. Because oh. it was full, 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 and then we would like. Yeah. And then yeah, by eight twenty-four. Nine yeah. of twenty-four. Twenty-four months. We just got home, and right now we are. Oh, girl, we are very tired, so I am gonna end this vlog here. by God's grace, <laughs> by God's grace, I by God's grace, so I am um, so happy, and I thank God that we made it safely. So now I'm gonna end this vlog and I hope you guys did enjoy it. Please don't forget to like, comment and subscribe to my channel. Um, let's get to 500 subscribers. And with that being said, I would love to love and leave you guys. And I'll see you on another Wednesday video.